What it is, what it do, YouTube, it's Shamisha, man, man, build a go, man. I'm back again with another damn video, man, another reaction video, man. Look, man, I'd just like to thank all of you guys for a thousand subscribers, man. We going crazy with this shit, man, and i still been rising, bro, and I haven't even dropped a video yesterday, and I'm sorry about that, man. The boy just got, you know what I'm saying, got a little, you know what I'm saying, tired and shit, blah, 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 man. But, hey, the grind don't stop, man, you know what I'm saying? Also, man, follow a nigga on Snapchat, man. And I also been looking at my analytics, bro. Um, that's the last time I'm gonna be looking at them shits, man. All the people that be watching the videos aren't subscribed to the video. So, or subscribe to my YouTube channel. But look, man, without further ado, we gonna go ahead and get right into the video, man. No more talking about that shit. Um, we gonna go ahead and get right into the video. Cadet Closure, y'all been wanting me to react to this, man. Closure, he, Closure. <laughs> I'm tired, man. Cadet, he got that he got that work, man. I know he do because I listen, you know, to his <sighs> behind the bars. I believe no, 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 no. It was it was either behind the bars or daily dubby. Ah, there's so many videos in my mind, bro. I cannot even understand. But without further ado, let's go ahead and get right into the video. Are you put the beat on? <laughs> Boom. Hey, I'm gonna make this is all true. This is all true, still. Based off true stories. Right, so, a big part of my life has been shit. I know I can't lie about that. And if I keep it real, when I'm a fool again, I'd have to write about that. See, word, I was still in love when I was slut. Just words, them scars weren't closed up. But since he gave me exposure, I saw me by, I told him my closure. Slut. Ooh. He said them scars wasn't closed up. <laughs> And now, you know, I'm getting all this out, like, with exposure. So he's exposing his scars, and now he's trying to close it up with this rap. That shit cold, bro. I ain't gonna lie. Let's continue, man. Man, I was so raw to the page. So raw to the extent now. When I even use more names, she reached, she texted me once in a match. So I kind of treat me like a German. Like, yo, that done the monkey bar thing, bro. Well, she's just doing her, man. Like, listen, yeah, I was all shocked. I've been thinking about this girl like every day, in every way So yeah, of course we speak and numbers exchange And now I'm happy as fuck Man, who did you fall in love with to make this whole song, bro? He, She probably cheated on a nigga, bro You know what I'm saying? He probably treated her like a king and shit They probably had their problems, ups and downs here and there But, like, he, she probably cheated on this nigga, bro To, to make a song this long, bro, you, you had to Hey, that them painful songs be the hits, man I'm trying to tell you now I'm back with the love of my life Doing all kind of shit Like it's no no for he was to a clock at night A good guy now I ain't hitting my never Even catch my car spitting together You know when the kiss is perfect Come like puzzle pieces fitting together Yeah I'm told that way If we're doing this then we gotta do this right I'ma tell you all the shit that I've been on the last couple years The shit you won't like but I'ma be honest man I'ma be rude to the teeth Oh got... they hit me with an ad I did not catch that bro That's crazy I'm gonna have to go back a little bit though. That shit fucked me up. Let's continue. I'ma be honest, man. I'ma be rude to the teeth. I will to make sure some next girl can never come to you about me. And that's when I started talking. When I told her all of the girls that I beat, all the problems with me. The one night stand on the girls that I'm real IG. But when it was her turn, she said, There ain't a dream I can sell you. I'm really my life being boring. I never ain't nothing to tell you. I might not believe her. Ah, oh, shit. So basically, he explained all his problems to her, man. And now she's basically saying that she really hasn't been doing anything. She's just been a typical in-house homebody girl. You know what I'm saying, man? So he, he said he believed her, man. I'm telling you, this, this is where he loses trust. I can see it. I can see it in his face, bro. It's based off a true story, so I know it's true, bro. You know what I'm saying? Niggas ain't gonna be spitting about no shit that they, you know, they ain't do. Well, some people do, but let's continue. I was naive, but well, after the girl I was thinking about for the last four years was by me. And like that feeling it weren't gonna wait. And the mummy would took us on the holiday. Now I'm deep in the night, go ease and shit. Couple months and I got the key to the crib, but, but then I got distant though. Cause I got that iffy vibe like I be catching up up to the silly lines like Oh shit, he bro, he think about every situation that they been in, they he like This shit is like <laughs> I don't know, it's something different about her, bro. Like, I ain't feeling that vibe. Like, you know what I'm saying? You get that iffy ass vibe from a nigga or a girl. Look, you like, I don't know, man. I'm, I'm, I'm starting to feel something different about her. I ain't talking about no love. If you're my woman, the why I gonna catch you up? Oh. And it's some shit. That shit you ain't even gonna lie about. And this is when I turn it 
turn it into a fuck boy Man, I can't lie, man, I just went with it Even though I still love them, man Certain couldn't see for my spirit Never called a beautiful wife No attention, her time had none of it The most I would do, pull up on a late night Random one, if I felt like I didn't That's when I got that phone call, though And you know what? Hey, hold on <laughs> I know, I know I, know. I paused it it's getting good, bro. No bullshit. This, this shit, hey, got my motherfucking heart beating hard as hell, man. I'm trying to tell you, I'm worried about this nigga and shit. Come on, man. What? What the? Where did the crib come from, bro? What the? What? Nigga, that crib was not by you, bro, at the beginning of the story, bro. That's the. <laughs> Whoa! Okay, 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 okay. Are you sure you're gonna have it? Yeah. Said, the doctors told her before that she can't have a baby. So the thought of having an abortion, no, not having a you is all crazy now. Look, see when a baby ain't planned. There's some stages you go through as a man. The first stage is, no, she ain't having a you. I gotta talk to her harder. The second stage is, look, man, I got my nut. Your parents is always gonna be there for day one, man. No bullshit. They don't. They, they ain't gonna call you a disappointment about this situation. They are always gonna be proud of you and they will take your back no matter what. It don't, I don't get no fuck with nobody said. Those are the people that care about you the most. Sometimes it be the parents, sometimes it be your friends. I, either way it go, bro, they will still like respect you and, you know, treat you as your own and they will love to see a mini you as well. That's crazy, ain't it? I'm right now, I'm excited But anyway, fuck that part It's the second part that hit me like life I got a phone call out of the blue that blame where you at Until you come round And I said no, and she said no So I said fuck it and go from south Blue until I pulled up to the crib Got in the lift, put the key for the door And all I can see is her there With her arms around her belly on the floor I'm not Oh shit, okay Okay, so <laughs> I just said family and all this shit, but then the sister wasn't even fucking with her. That's fucked up. I ain't gonna lie to you. That's that's crazy. I, I did listen to that part. You know what I'm saying? I ain't have to go back to it. But, okay, so she's going through it right now. I don't know if this is, um, if she's in labor right now, you know what I'm saying? Her water broke or whatever, or she's just getting like these type of stomach pains from maybe she possibly had an abortion. She probably didn't. Let's continue though. Yo, baby, tell me what's wrong. She's saying I'm blessed and my belly keeps hurting. I keep falling in the ambulance over and over again, but the shit ain't working. They pull up and what seems like forever. Me, I'm shocked at the Norway means. We get to the hospital, we'll take her blood. Holding the hand, waiting to be seen. And then some young white lady steps in. She clears her thoughts, she looks up slow and says you're no longer pregnant. Oh, that's an empty crib. Oh, my God. I, oh, she had a miscarriage, bro. God damn. Ah, shit. No, 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 no. That kind of hit me in the worst way, bro. It happened like three days before my birthday. Oh, my. I was back on track. But I can't lie, I was sure I ain't giving it. Because I got this feeling saying that I can't trust her. I look, man, I can't get rid of her. But I got to talk to her. I got to talk to her. I'm going to see her next week. And that's when I'll talk to her. I picked her up so I could drop her at the airport. I said I'm tired. She can drive. Oh my god, three days, man. Three days, man. Okay, so yeah, let me correct people. She didn't have an abortion. She just, she was having a miscarriage, basically, which is crazy. That, I'm sorry about that, cadet. No bullshit. That, that's, that's crazy, bro. What I'm about to say, man, I ain't trying to cuss you. I really want to make this work, but. I feel like I can't trust you I look, I don't know what it is But I got a feeling so deep in my ribs Months ago you was gonna have a kid But now I feel like the solution is to Let me have a look in your phone Get the trust in Google something You'll probably be cussing like I told you there was nothing in my phone The word of my life, I'll let that go But let me have a look in your phone And then she said no and I Oh, I told you, what I say? what I say? Is it that she cheating? You know what I'm saying? Is 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 that's the only reason? Like you you ain't gonna let her see the phone? You know what I'm saying? You 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 will catch everything. <laughs> you will catch every fucking punch, bro. When you look at that phone, you catch every punch, nigga. I'm talking about everything. So what if what if that wasn't even his baby? What if what if that was the? Let, let's continue. Hold on. Said what? I swear you want me to take you serious. I'm worried that's what I'm trying to do. So you gotta respect how I'm trying to move. Five years deep, you'll let that go. Just do not let me look in the phone. She looked back with a woman and scared face. And then she said, No, man. Look, you see that kind of iffy. Man, I let that go so quickly. So went to the airport just to let her off. And then I put my key right for the letterbox. Look, what was in her phone, man, I would never know. 
five years. You let five years just go in the drain like that. You know what I'm saying? That's oh okay. So we so we still don't know what's in that girl phone, huh? Five years, huh? I got phone call two days later. She's like, hi, I'm not one of She's like, now you can look for my phone. I'm like, shut up. <laughs> so I'm in shortage. And I see her cousin. And she pulls me to the side that I don't want to talk to you about something. And I'm not calm if you step out the box. I mean, you can go speak in the car. And she's like, I don't talk to my cousin no more, man. She takes things kind of far. And I'm not way there. What do you want to say to me? And she goes, um. See, it's getting suspenseful. I know y'all look, bro. So fucking pause it, bro. No, <laughs> stop, shut up. You know what I'm saying? All I know is, it, like I said, bro, my, my heart's still beating, bro. That this this is a crazy situation, though. Like, I'm loving this song, bro. He, he going nuts with this shit. Storyteller for real. When he was with her, uh, she was uh, to a couple men. And there was this guy from work. And when she was having this kid, she showed up to my crib car. She wasn't sure like, if it was yours or his. And what the fuck did I just say, bro? Oh my god, dog. That shit crazy. I'm telling you, bro. Like, now you wanna you want me to look through your phone now, bro? You just deleted everything, bro. Two days later, bro, you want me to look in your phone now, bro? It's already done. It's, it's said and done. Five years just went down the drain like that. Snap of a finger. It's just life lessons. After the miscarriage, shit go crazy. She looked back at miscarriage. I suggest you miscarriage my baby. She said, wait, that brain are you sure? I said, I saw her. Wait, come on now. Wait, <laughs> stop playing, bro. Wait, come on, bro. When this happened, find the end of it. I said, yeah, you know. She said, fuck, man, this dog's a trick. I said, wait, what do you mean? She said, I'm going to do his life, I'm talking. On the middle of February, I'm talking to get in the bullshit. Oh, what the? Oh, my God. Oh. Whoa. So you telling me, my nigga, you, you telling me, hold on, hold on, hold on, look at, look, camera, look at my face. So you telling me that she was having these bleeding problems because of the abortion and now you, you made him take you to the doctor and then had a doctor, was a doctor in it too? Like saying like, yeah, you ain't gonna be pregnant no more. What the fuck? See, y'all a fuck like that. Yeah, man fuck up, but man fuck up, they fuck like that. Are you even clocking the play? So the miscarriage and her being on the floor was on stage. And then they asked why man so bitter. I might take my advice, because I'm just killing it, aka the slug, you feel me? right here man uh I, that's that's crazy bro i'm i'm you see how these men get now bro that you trust one bro and then you just fuck it up with every other woman now you know what i'm saying so man look go ahead comment what y'all want me to react to man thank y'all like i said man for a thousand subscribers bro the next goal is 5k man i know that's a long way from here but i know we can definitely make it man uh i said 5k by the end of summer um also um i think I'm, I'm i'm a definitely like monday was just a little day that i needed to you know just to unwind and shit but we finna go crazy man consistency wise um i'm dropping a video at least a video to two or three videos at least every day you know what i'm saying man i'm gonna get prepared for this shit but it's your homie it's your man man build a go and i'm out man peace gang